Okay. Yo, yo, yo. You know who it is. Coming back live at you. It is Planet Paper Boy. Who's that? With another pickup. Uh, when I first saw images of these, I thought these were going to be extremely hard to get. Not even going to lie to you, but um, <clears throat> it was the total opposite. <clears throat> people actually didn't really want these. I mean, they made a, a lot of them, and I know a lot of people did pick these up. But as far as like the, the crazy amount of masses that went after like the lost and founds, <sighs> these were sitting for a while. What? No way. Well, I don't think I've ever seen a shoe of this magnitude sit like that for as much as it did. And Nike even had to pull them because I was watching it because I was actually contemplating getting another pair. But I was like, ah, why do I need it? And I was getting the Ama Minia 4s anyway, so that's another issue. Um, but I was like, yeah, I don't need two of these. Watching it, and I saw it had a full-size one, and then like 10 minutes later, it was like sold out. And then it, then I think they put it on the uh, like the app or the like the desktop version or some other thing like that. But um, I'm surprised these things sat. I'm not even going to lie. But I'm happy they did because it made it really easy for me to get. I actually bought these from Pata, which is a UK um, website. Because I thought sneakers... I wasn't trusting the sneakers app after the Lost and Found. Not anymore. So I didn't take a chance at it because I really wanted these. But look how soft this leather is, man. I would say this is the softest shoe I've ever felt in my life. My life. Well, softest Jordan 5, I would say. Definitely. I've felt a lot of shoes before. Pause. But, um, yeah, this is really, really. <laughs> Look at that crap. Um, the one thing I don't like about this is I wish it wasn't as, it feels really big. It feels... That's what she said. Or he said. It feels like I almost could have went a full size down. But, um. My foot is like right here, and I'll show you at the on foot, but it's still pretty good. I'm gonna put one with the blue laces, to, you know, let you see how it looks. But take a look at this leather, man. Sorry, I'm all over the place. You see, slowing up a little more with this. I like it has 3M. I did not know it has 3M in the back there. 3M means it lights up for the people that don't know what 3M is. I'm sure everyone that's watching this does. Um, the inside is really good, quilted inside, just like the Ama. Minya fours. Uh, this one says keep, and the other one says going. That's what she said. <laughs> DJ Cal's met, you know, motto. I'm not gonna spam his motto because every review I see, you know, has to say the crap that he's been saying over months and months and months. <laughs> and you know what I mean, like that. And God did. All right, that's the only one I'm gonna say. But um, I like that the back have two different things. I like that a lot. And I like that it's stitched. You know, it's not like some kind of other way that you could put it in. It just looks really, really, really nice, you know. I'm glad he got his shoe. Hopefully they make another one. I don't know if they will because this one kind of sat. But, hey, I'm happy I got my pair. Tell me what you guys think. Like, comment, and subscribe. And this one says even we the best on the bottom. Like, they really kind of went in on this shoe, man, like with the detail. So, I'm not going to be one of those YouTubers where like, you guys are going to regret not getting this. I don't know if you guys are or not. There's just so much shoes coming out that shoes like this, I don't think gets, I don't think even has room to get the the justice that it deserves because there's just so much to choose from. The I'm, I'm in years, the lost and founds, I mean, those are like the best shoe of the year. So, I understand why people aren't really, you know, going after these because everyone's still so hypnotized by that lost and found. So, I understand. You know, if I didn't get the lost and founds, I don't know if I'll be on. No, I would be on. I ain't gonna lie. I like these. <laughs> That's just me. But, um, yeah, I'm going to put one of the blue laces in right now to, you know, let you guys see how it is. And maybe I'll put one of these other laces in here, too. Let's put the um, let's put the cream laces in here because I haven't seen anybody do the cream laces. I've seen someone do the black laces, and I think the black laces look good since it has this black, black back tab. <laughs> but uh, let's see what it looks like with the other two laces. All right. Now, uh, here's what they look like with the blue laces. Now, I think it really goes good with the, the lining and obviously the this little shark teeth on the midsole. Um, nine out of ten, this is how I will be wearing them. Or with the black in, with the, the black laces. But now let's show you what it looks like with the... With the All right, I figured I'd uh, put both of them in here, the black and the white laces. You know, politically correct I am. But uh, like I said, I like it with the black laces a lot. Uh, I think it really makes that back piece stand out, and it just puts a little bit more of a masculine feel to it, if I may. You know, a lot of people ain't really 
rocking the the salmon or, or whatever the peach what you want to call it i like the color I, I like it i actually like this color a little bit better than the the white color but it's just my preference but uh, i think the white laces look good i think all laces look good and i mean when's the last time have you seen us get so many lace options with a sneaker they gave us like four laces and these laces aren't even the same size which is whack the blue laces is definitely longer than the salmon laces and i think the white laces are a little bit shorter than all of them but eh, it is what it is. If that's my only complaint, I'm really lucky. I feel sorry for the people that got mold on their lost and found ones, or even sometimes got mold on their Amma Minier fours. I mean, that's just oh, that's just rough. I feel I really, you know, sympathize for people that have uh, have that issue. I really, really hope they did something for you. But let's go to the on foot and uh, end the video there. We're not gonna leave up. Oh, look at that. I like I like how they have this strip here. I didn't even see that. It's kind of like a like the peach color on the bottom, but that's the only way, only place they have it though. It's on the, on the tip of the shoe. That's pretty dope. We the best. Hmm. Like, comment, and subscribe. Planet Paper Boy. All right, guys, this is what the DJ Khaled Air Jordan 5 looks like on feet. Tell me what you guys think. I do have the 3M on them. So you can see how they light up. I like how that toe cap on the bottom has that salmon color. They feel really good on feet as far as comfortability. I would definitely say go a half size down though. Easily go a half size down. I don't even, I don't even care if you have a wide foot. I think going a half size down, these are gonna make you really comfortable. With the, the quilted inliner, this feels amazing. Tell me what you guys think. I like it better with the black laces. But I also like it with the blue laces. Just want to give you guys different options because there's plenty of on feet with the blue laces on. Like, comment, and subscribe. You know who it is, man. I'll be back after you with those Amma Minya 4s real soon.